Let's share in communion together. Jesus was brought before the chief priests, the elders, the religious leaders, the entire Supreme Jewish Council. They wanted to crucify him. And crucify him they did, nailing, to, nailing him to a cross, standing between heaven and earth. John was standing beneath the cross with Jesus' mother. And he wrote, before Jesus bowed his head and surrendered his life to God, Jesus said, it is finished. Jesus was stating he himself had fulfilled the law and accomplished everything God had sent him to do, to bring salvation to the whole world. Salvation is through Jesus Christ alone. Nothing you or I do can achieve this. Not keeping laws, not striving, not being good enough. Absolutely nothing. Jesus has done it all. Paul writes, all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. And the punishment for sin is death. But the free gift of God is eternal life in Christ Jesus our Lord. It is finished. What Jesus did on earth, being obedient to the Father, unto death and rising again, is enough for salvation for the whole world. You are valued. You are accepted. You are forgiven. You are loved. You are loved by the Father. So let's pray. Jesus, we thank you so much for everything you have done. You submitted to hard people, to mockings, to beatings, to painful trials, to persecutions and trauma, giving up your, all your rights, all the time honouring your tormentors, your Father's plan to bring salvation to the world. Thank you, Jesus, for loving your Father and not holding on to your own life, but giving all up and finally declaring, it is finished. We praise you, Jesus. Let us drink and eat together.